so let's see how it goes let's see how it goes guys um i'm still on on a sell on euro usd as you all know as you all can see so guys you can see you are welcome again to my channel so in today's video we'll be talking about euro usd analysis so we'll be diving deep into euro usd analysis and to see what's happening in the market so here right now um i'll say this is a, a, a kind of a correction is a kind of a correction that the market is making this is not i don't think this is a reversal i don't think this is a reversal this is a kind of correction and the market will come back down oh it can definitely come back down it will retrace to this 50 and as you can see it's on exactly 50 percent fib retracement level so here in case you don't know about fibonacci uh, i might make a video on fibonacci how to plot and how to set it up on your on your chart so um uh, the next video that's what i might do for you so in case you might be asking how to get the fib retracement so and for those who know it already let's go on because i'll do it for those who don't know it i'll do the video for those who don't know it right now so you can see on this fib retracement level you see the 50 percent is a, a, a is around the 50 percent right now the 50 percent and if we should go more it should go to the 61 and the 78 percent so this these are the place i'm expecting it to go so you can see but right now it's on the uh, on the 50 percent look at the market here that's where the price is right now so i'm still hoping for it to sell more euro usd i'm i'm, I'm uh, my bias on it is to sell so let me go again so that's one confirmation that's one confirmation the second confirmation which i see here right now is uh based on my uh, trend line break and retest this market is somehow retesting after this break there should be a retest so this is the retest which i'm seeing right now this is not a reversal it's a kind of a retest and after this retest what is going to happen is the market will fall back down will continue to each power movement which is on which is the downtrend so you can see the market is on the downtrend so let me delete this here so you can see clearly so you can see now so this is a a, a kind of a break a break correction then back down boom so let's see this is a downtrend like you can see this is a, a fucking downtrend like you can see here is a, a big this is a big downtrend the market is uh, on, on, on a very big move downtrend like right now so i'm expecting it to come to this 27 level 27.0 percent level so that is where i'm expecting the market to come but for for the sake of clarity let's go more let's go more let me give you let me give you more confirmation let me give you more confirmation uh, this is the second confirmation and the third confirmation again is on the psychological level as you can see psychological level one eight one eight zero 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 so uh, uh, psychological level one point zero eight hundred eight thousand so and it's reacting to the psychological level as you can see you can see this weak rejection you can see the rejection you can see this candle uh, pattern formation which is which it has bring out here so you can see the uh, and you can see immediately it start forming some kind of a, a hanging man let me say yeah a kind of a hanging man so it's it's coming back down so that's like the fifth confirmation uh let me give you let me give you one more one more one more one more fifth channel fib retracement channel no this is not what i'm i'm looking for this is not what i'm looking for it should be here it should be here parallel channel so i'm looking for the parallel channel so i'm on the four hour in case you are asking about the time frame i'm on the four hour time frame right now so i want to plot this fifth channel again so i'll see clearly what is happening again
so on this flip channel you can see rising is just a rising wedge and the market let me so this is a fifth confirmation uh also so what i'll do right now is where is my projection to still on a short so anything can happen this is the market i'm not controlling the market but this is my bias the, based on what i'm trading this is my bias this is what i'm looking up to you understand me this is what i'm looking up to so this one should be five zero four five nine percent so you can set your sl above this 61 and your tp here and let's see how it will play out because this is the market i'm not controlling the market anything can happen it might go back up and take us out our sl and it might go to our tp in any of it we are in so this is the target the target is 157 pips if it goes to our favor and if it doesn't go to our favor the loss is 67.1 so if you risk a little on this it's not bad it's a good risk to reward it's a good risk to reward so this is all i want to show you in this video and uh, in our next video i would love to talk about the fib yes of which i have said i love to talk about the fib channel or the fib retracement channel or i'll go more into something else to talk about so that's what we are up to that's what we should be up to in our next video so guys this is all i have to say for now so guys in all i'll make the video and i'll still get back to you yeah in all i'll make the video and still get back to you guys i love you peace out one love thanks for coming